marketing wise because you're traveling around a lot and things like that um what what's kind of been a couple of the ways that has helped you generate you know leads and sales for this online business yeah so basically i started out just doing some organic uh stuff like when i first started when like when i had like literally no clients um and that's how most people start because you're not going to be going and you know whacking a whole heap of, of of a budget on on paid ads if you're just getting started but um once I did discover the world of paid ads, I really did prefer paid ads because uh, paid advertising allows you to obviously get a lot more leads a lot faster and you can scale faster um, and you're able to just, you know, throw more fuel on the fire, so to speak. So I've worked with, a, I've invested in also, you know, a few different marketing agencies. I've worked with a few people. I've learned, I mean, I know how to run ad campaigns myself now as well. I've taken the time to actually pay people to teach me how to do that. Not to like a professional level, but to a level where I can put together an effective campaign. Um, but yeah, running paid ads was a big one on Instagram, Facebook primarily. Um, that's been a, a massive way of generating leads for me. Obviously, I won't you know go into the nitty gritty of what the ads were or how we did it, but um, but yeah, that that was that. Uh, however, obviously, a lot of the organic methodologies and strategies as well. Um, you know they are they are just as important and i was saying to you just before jimmy that like before we were kind of neglecting the organic and just doing the paid ads and because now i've got two virtual assistants that work uh you know with me and help me um i don't want to i can't be there you know sending organic messages all day every day or i really don't want to um so i've been able to get the get the vas to come in and do that for me um at a pretty good level and you know we're always we're always aiming to improve but what I've found the the sweet spot is making sure you're doing both, you know, making sure you, you you've got the organic stuff happening. Um, and you've also, you're also running paid ads as well. If you can get them both working simultaneously, um, you know, that that's where you want to be. So. I mean, it's so funny. Your journey um, was very similar to, to mine in the, in the gyms is in the gyms, we did a lot of organic and then we realized what, what this paid advertising thing is and just dropped everything. It was just, spending like so freely on ads and then after a while we're like look we probably should have multiple um lead flows just in case ad accounts get shut down and, and things like that um but mate i've had a look over your ad accounts i'm very impressed you are i think you're underselling yourself a bit you're like extremely savvy um on running paid ads i was i was really impressed when i got a chance to to have a look over it and i guess the the real benefit of of paid ads are for for any business is it just markets for you twenty four seven. So you know whilst organic is really important and you've got an amazing team, I just sleep easier knowing in my businesses that ads are running. So on a Sunday, if you don't do an organic post or send a message or whatever, you're still generating leads and interest within your program, which um, I think is just a really powerful position to be in as a business owner. Yeah, 